Welcome back to News 18 this morning. It is 641 and it is Friday, so guess what that means? It means it's another chance to talk about all local treats. So News 18's Cody Malin joins us with another edition of Food Truck Friday. Cody, I have to laugh again at that graphic behind you. We love it. it makes me laugh every time I see it. So awesome. But there's nothing better to talk about so early in the morning than coffee. So what all do you have for us today? Marley, you are exactly right. It is what keeps us going every day and that is what I'm focusing on that perfect treat for us morning folks. Today's food truck once again may not focus on food but it is something that is sure to give us fuel for the day. Travel and Tom's coffee is hot off the line. The food truck may only be one week old but already it is making its way across the greater Lafayette area. Travel and Tom serves your usual coffees and frappes but also offers something a little unique, a nitro lemonade for non-coffee drinkers. Now that's a nitrogen infused lemonade, yeah, that gives a smoother and creamier experience. Owner of Lafayette's Travel and Tom's Tim Valiant says our coffee goes beyond giving people a pick-me-up, it also serves as a way to give back. It's been said that the, the best coffee is the coffee that comes to you, <laughs> and, and that's certainly true. Um, our, we have an exclusive bean. Uh, it's a blend of a bean from Kona, Hawaii and from Nicaragua, and it supports the family uh, farmers down there. So it's a, it's, it's a really great story. Some pretty cool stuff this morning. Valiant's truck is one of the first in the country to roll out. Now I did also want to give a special shout out to Travelin' Tom's Coffee. The truck was here Monday to treat the folks at WLFI and we went crazy and took advantage of that. I tried their lemonade firsthand and I can say it was very refreshing, especially with these hot temperatures. Now next week I'll be sharing another local food truck, so make sure you wake up early and bring your appetite. In studio this morning, Cody Malin, News 18.